Welcome to Bardemic Round 2. I'm Crazy K. Lee Nice, Verbal Anime. I'm playing the villain today. Hey, we're to go. Sensei! So finally we meet. My boy, I had you pissed in a few weeks. Was you feeling defeat? Was the thought of losing to someone in their third battle have you rattled? Well, it's time that we speak. I mean, look what we got here. Local bed of battle. Damn near 40. What did you say your record was? And not uh, one recording. We know you want to mention helping me in my battle. So what? I done came off that high. You're still stuck up thinking you're a rap god. What you need to think about is a damn job abroad instead of giving yourself hand jobs. I mean, what kind of mess are you, bro? Of course you got the advantage. You get to stay at home, play on your phone, do live recordings to show that you're alone. I've seen the one on Spider-Man 3. Was you having a tantrum? Because dog, my niece asked the same thing. What? <laughs> Imagine a grown man mad about plastic. How sad and tragic that the toy that you bought from the store didn't have any real magic. Speaking of pictures, did you find what you need, Nate? Going through my albums and my uploads? It's like a desperate man. This is a new can to making. A star like Troy Aikman going against the rap version of Clay Aiken. It's 2020, dog. There's no need for debating. Just know that I'm too paid to be hating. Time. Yeah, I'm glad you wore that. Because look, Kenny. You dead in six. What's your name? Can I call you Carl? Nah, it don't even matter, man. Your brain getting splattered when it revolve around this. Because the blade I'm with came to slit your way, colonizer. See, this is a hydron collider. And it set a course. And, uh, Ken, my every metaphor mean you metaphors. But I'll be directing this. James Gunn. You know why? Because every line sink you to a suicide. See, that push you aside. Off rip. No joke. No Jack, he, the Joaquin. Just the letter. And we know you the bottom, bitch. You stilettos broke trash. Fuck assumptions. Check the stats. You grabbed the one once. Now you somehow advanced. We'll meet the cheat code, Neo. When you see light, I adapt. You a corpse. I stutter back. Shoot it, forced it. See your shit sandwiched on the floor. In a stupor, I'll flash back to the future. You a loser. Used to users maneuvering through your post and sound bites. You used to dying for exposure. Shit, it's closure you found nice. <laughs> for you, this a multiverse. For me, I see you barely change. And that explains the killing joke. No matter where it carved blood in every bar, bruh, some bitch get. You know what I hate? It's a shame I see you killed. Except sometimes, you know, even I got extra bills. She get exit still a box, sealed and dropped. I figure you hating. Yeah, the whole round was surgical, okay? The bullet points fragment statements. They aiming at a mental patient saying, even if he die, he win. You right. Cause I'm the guy straightening the jacket when the clip tie you in. Hey, I learned this in a battle. And I know you're into this kind of rap, so let's key in the facts with a game called Swear to God. Okay. You swear to God that I didn't get under your skin for talking that shit and had you hurt like a little bitch. I was joking, swear to God. Swear to God that you went in a group chat acting like a kid, looked down at an announcement, followed by some negative shit. They tried to reschedule your death, <laughs> swear to God. You swear to God you went talking shit about someone's dead mama over a vote and said it was karma. That didn't apply to Bardemi. <laughs> I mean, damn dude, I can stop there with round two. Thinking you're a villain? Well, I must be the hero, exposing you as a zero. Dog, you ain't a villain, you're just an asshole with an ego. And I've got the heart in this jungle like Bravestone. I'm the man. You got witty lines? Well, I got my own stand. I mean, I made you in my wrestling game, I thought that was cool. And 
You know, I appreciate the help too. But dude, did you go through all of my pictures? Like, time. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. No, I didn't, man. But round two, this is where it get worse for you. I'll let the angle adjust. See, this scope of you from the war zone where you don't meet the Call of Duty enough. So these punches slide on you how M. Bison does. One forward move, he down. Now he down moving forward. Ryu uppercut. But nerd twist, allow Lee to disrupt your chi. You a fucking muggle to beat me. You need he who can't be named to lead. You need Megatron, the Decepticons, a Gundam with his weapons arm, plus an Avenger team. And every dying star Thanos snapped from afar. While Spawn look on through that triple beam. Now, that's a hell of a scheme, right? It's because I'm smoking you. You inhaling your dreams. I'm playing devil's advocate. Keanu leaves and you cripple playing hero, weirdo. You Christopher Reeves, see? You got this cartoon, I should get canceled vibe. I guess it's Teen Titans vs. Teen Titans Go. Hey Reagan, I'm saying Lil Cuzzo got better shows than Slime. Swag, five months for this, five kids drop out, the bag go down, and I get him. Well, when you know I'm in a bracket, nobody went in, don't give me the victim from the bracket where someone rehashed all your shit. Yeah, because that was the best K they ever seen. I don't care what one of y'all want for it. This I paid to see. You got the nerve to confirm you can earn a legacy? Well, when the clip go viral, I hope your ghost returns, nerd, then he can earn this respect from me. We know how long this man's lectures can be. And I ain't got all day, so I'll make this short and sweet. What a nice day to be alive. Except for you, Ned. Have you had it up to here yet? Your blood pressure rising? I mean, do we need to get a heat check? See, I was determined to beat you. But we don't have to make it to the end to know you ain't going to be part of the sequel. Crazy K. The one they doubted. Showing exactly what they founded. The underdog that stayed grounded going against the town's so-called profounded. And <laughs> you wanted this, K. Kay. Okay? And with the pressure, it was easier for this diamond to be engaged. See, I see where you did a show for Berglin and accepted that as an accomplishment, but who really acknowledged it? How if your own supply, that's your only source of confidence. But don't bat an eye against this super guy, because in a flash, he'll pass on any one of you guys without even giving a try. <laughs> Time. You know, after that, this third, like, dirt on your grave site. You know how the first led you to the walking dead? It's because you a shit show, someone made hype. Bro. In real life, I never liked you anyway, you silly motherfucker. I'm Nino Tableside. See, I cancel this bitch and buy another. I see you as your mother's runny nose yelling, Stay alive! Because you knew this was... Man, you knew. Hey, Ingram, I assume I'm up to. Clear. And in another two verse you... I'll be up another two, clear? Okay, you still here? <laughs> Yo, I knew you would be. You the fanatic in the front seat, uh, another one of Lee's stands, trying to stand in as a Stan Lee, but one stanza turned me, Tony Danza, to this geek. A boss, Springsteen. One stick, dust him off, Spring Clean. I heard you don't like gun bars. This still sting, you the undercover blood sucker. Shit, I killed Van Helsing. Yeah. And the first thing I said was I came with a blade. You ain't catch it, huh? 
See, I knew you had Asperger's. Now y'all start catching on, cause every character in the bar is tailor fit to help you tag along. Shit, I could have schemed a Pokemon theme if I knew they'd catch them all. Mm. But nah, this was personal. Tailor fit even. It ain't meant for judgment. You see the same corpse I'm seeing. Cause every sign placed in his mind redefined him into one being. Just that average fucking henchman who got inked in for no reason.